Welcome back, guys. Lots to tell you. I've been reading up and, and, and finding out about the new update and finding out what the issues are and what we need to look out for and all that kind of stuff. And I've got a few things that I need to do. Um, let's see. This I got wrong, which a lot of you told me. Thank you for telling me. So that should be all except... Uh, well, it should be all except the polluted dirt and slime. And that should not have slime in it. Oh, good. It's not included. Oh, oh, now that's interesting. It's automatically filtered out slime. Now, is that, is that the same for anything new that you find? No, apparently not. Okay, well, that's good. Uh, we've got loads of fertilizer. We've got loads of algae. We've got coal. Uh, seeds. We're doing well for seeds. Although, atmospheric pressure is too low up there. Uh, I've been I've been filling in a bit of the base, getting the you know tiles and that kind of stuff done. We're getting the research done. Stress is actually coming down. That's good news, right? Um, one thing. Okay, first thing. Uh, this is a big change. Millwood millwood plants don't automatically uh, give you a seed when they when when you've harvested them three times. Uh, it used to get a seed and they used to replant and it was just a constant source of food. Now, you get three harvests from them and that's it, they're gone. So, we're going to have to start uh, using bristle blossoms. Now, bristle blossoms are much harder to grow. Uh, like, a lot harder to grow. So, we're going to have to get that done. And that's going to be, like, kind of a priority. So, oh, that's ready for harvest. Oh, well, we should harvest that then. Get some food off that. Uh, but those, okay, these could definitely be dug out, uh, and that could definitely be dug out, and we'll dig that one out as well. But I guess these two will harvest. Right, so this, we're going to start planting our, our bristle blossom down here, and I'll, I'll tell you the details of why it's difficult to grow down there. Okay, these are growing. We're starting to get some oxygen up here. Good news. Yeah, the, the oxygen's constantly going up. How are we doing oxygen-wise? We are net gain, just about. Good, that's what we like to see. Uh, I think we can we can speed things up now. Uh, I want to get through here so we can get this. We've still got 12,500 calories, though, so we're not kind of desperate. Uh, and now the reservoir, we're going to put, the, uh, put a reservoir in here. So I'm trying to get that done as well. But I've given them quite, there's a, there's a fair amount of work for them to do so. Uh, now food, where are we going to store food? Because this is unrefrigerated, so food will go bad in there. Now there's a few places that you can put it. If you put it somewhere cold, it'll, it'll work. Uh, if you put it in uh, if, uh, what is essentially a sterile environment, it'll work. So if you put it like in with a load of CO2, uh, that will also work uh, to preserve the food. Uh, oh, our research is complete. We've done liquid piping. What next? What next? What next? We're going to do power regulation next. Right, there we go. Get on with that, Sky. He's our researcher. I did make a couple of changes to the uh, to the jobs, which was, I think it was, yeah, it was to let Zach Vader um, sweep and deliver. I'd taken him off sweeping and delivering, and I've forgotten he's a, he's a bodybuilder. He can carry a lot, so he's very efficient at carrying stuff around. And in fact, uh, May... Well, May's the good digger, though, so I want her primarily digging. So, no, we'll, we'll, we'll keep her digging. I'm not going to bring a new duplicate. Well, let's have a look. If there's a really good one. Um, no. <laughs> no, definitely not. Yeah, we'll get rid of those and we'll, we'll, pick, we'll pick somebody else. Now, I did, I did post on my, uh, on, on my Patreon to my uh, Patreon supporters and uh, let them know they could have their names in the game. And... We'll get a few, get a couple of people named. Our first person to reply was Wendy. So, Wendy. It's actually Wendy Van Baggum. So, Wendy VB. There you go, Wendy. You're in the game. So, we've got Wendy and Ralph Cock. <laughs> people who've watched my other series will, will, will know about Ralph Cock. That is his name. K O K, Ralph Cock. And uh, Ralph's just had a baby, little Tyler. And he, um, he wanted me to. Put Tyler in the game. So yeah, we'll put Tyler in. Why the hell? Why not? So this is going to be Tyler. Although, like, why you would want to put your <laughs> your little baby in the game 
Because <laughs> very good chance of something something terminal happening. So I hope you're not going to be too upset if something bad happens. Well, we're going to extend this ladder down a little bit to there. Now, talking of ladders, this ladder here is going to be a very important ladder. This ladder is going to go all the way down here. And it's going to go all the way up there as well. And that's, that's going to be our exploring ladder. So we'll find out what's up there and we'll find out what's down here. That should be, uh, that should be kind of fun. This bedroom up here needs to be sorted out. So let's get that sorted out. Let's put that across there. And we'll do it the way that we, um, we did uh, this bedroom. I don't see any reason why we would do it any different. And Sky's in there, so I want to keep him happy. Lighting, we want a couple of ceiling lights up in here. Cool. We want ceiling lights in other places too. So um, this room's going to be the same, isn't it? So, yeah, so we're going to have a ceiling light there and there. Yeah, do we do the same here? I think we probably do. Let's have a couple of ceiling lights in there. All right, cool. Uh, let's have a look at the decor. How are we doing decor-wise? Decor. This is staggeringly nice up here. Down here, yeah, not quite so nice. So I think we'll we'll do something about that. Let's have, let's have a couple of sculpting blocks in here. There and there. Keep everybody happy here. Uh, here, this is going to be the same layout as up here, isn't it? So that's going to be sculpting blocks there and there. And we're going to have blank canvases there and there. What I'm trying to do is just make the place as nice as possible to keep the stress levels down as much as we possibly can. Need to do some cabling. Now, this the, the cabling that I'm putting in at the moment is going to be primarily for just for the lighting. And we'll be doing, putting in different circuits for different things, um, I hope. I should probably be thinking about running heavy what wire but now nah, maybe just for now we'll kind of not worry about it too much so let's get that lighting done and that lighting done will run cable through there get that light and that light cool excellent yeah do i do you know what what the hell let's do let's do a couple of lights there as well yeah I, well no no, I'm not going to do those because I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to put down here yet. So, so cancel that. That's got to go up there and across there into there. And then across there and into that. And then we need a ladder that's going to go up the side of here to there. And we can dig that out, I guess. Yeah, we can dig that out. Cool. Should we go and listen to them snoring? Ah. Oh. They're all having a very nice time. Sky, what the hell are you doing? Oh, the other thing I need to do, I do need to put in another toilet. I do need to put in another toilet. Let's get that done and let's actually prioritise that because we don't want another accident. Um, we want another outhouse, which we're going to put, I think, there. No, hang on, that's that's in two from that side. So we want it in two, so we want it there. Yeah, all right, let's, let's make this priority nine. So, yeah, get that done, please, somebody. It's more important than anything that you're doing right now. Is anybody going to work on it? Oh, Nanny G. And, yeah, dig that out. Come on, somebody else. Zach digs the other one. And a bunch of copper ore. And boom. We've got another outhouse. Excellent. So we shouldn't have any more accidents. Now, this um, this little bit of... A polluted water down here there's about I don't know, there's about a kilogram of it just over a kilogram of it so what we can do is we could just mop that up there we go and they'll get rid of that in oh, oh i thought i thought you were gonna come oh here we go yeah now i don't want to mop too much Uh, I think it's just that bit now. So, come on. Come on. Yeah, there we go. I think it's gone. I think it's gone. Cancel. Done it? Yeah. That could probably cost us a bit of water, but I can live with it. I can live with it. 
Now, why am I putting gas permeable tiles here? It's because if we get any carbon dioxide, I want it to go through here and go down here, and this is going to be our carbon dioxide sink down here. That's the general plan. Right. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, we've got another hatch. God, we're getting lots of hatches. All, like all of these um, buried objects. Can I, I, now, I don't know whether it contains like a random thing or it's pre-generated or whatever, but um, you either get like seeds or hatches or like whatever. And people are seeing a lot of hatches in the game, which is kind of good news because hatches are good. Zach. Zach needs some help, I think. Let's get this. And priority nine, attack. Go. Well, kill it, guys. Come on. Help, Zach. Come on. Yeah, get down here. Oh, he killed it on his own. Good job. But he now has light wounds, which um, which is going to slow him down. It doesn't increase his stress. People have said it increases the stress. It doesn't. But uh, we, now we need to sweep this and get this cleaned up. We've got room, so let's get that done. That's it. Well, let's, let's have a, a good old sweep of the base, shall we? Yeah, let's have a good old sweep. So we definitely want to sweep anything that's... Yeah, well, yeah, let's sweep anything that's there. Clear this area out. We'll sweep up there as well. Now, polluted dirt. That's a good point. Uh, polluted dirt we want over here, don't we? Yeah, we do. So let's have a storage compactor. Um, yeah, let's just put a storage compactor in there. Let's prioritise that and get that built. Oh, bedtime. How are we doing, guys? Oh, look at the decor. The decor. Oh, God, it's blinding. It's blinding. We need to get the rest of the place looking nice. And that is the general idea. We want a gas permeable tile in there. Uh, we want to deconstruct that one and put a gas permeable tile in there. And then now down here, we can start putting in our blossoms. So let's um, let's do that. Let's do that. Where are we? What do I want? I want uh, food, and I want planter boxes, and I want. Now let's see. Uh, that's the edge. So I. Ideally, we kind of want them there, 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 and there, and then we can leave that one. Okay, cool. We we are getting this done. Have they? Put, okay, they've done that. So now, if we set that to be, um, let's see. I just want polluted polluted dirt, and I guess they can put the slime up there for now. Yeah, and I'm going to prioritise that a little bit. Get that done. Right, let's go over here. Now I can show you this. Now, this is kind of interesting because it gives you all the details here when, when, you, when you plant it. But if you then click on, well, when somebody does it. Come on. Oh, look at the stress. Stress is good. Come on, somebody plant that. Right. So if you click on the plant, it doesn't then give you all the details of exactly like what growing conditions it needs. But if you click on the planter box, then it does. So that's that's where you find this stuff. So uh, it takes 10 cycles to grow initially. Regrowth is two cycles. But this is the thing. It needs a temperature between 12 and a half degrees C and 22 and a half. And that is a very narrow band. And right, what are we at the moment? 22, 21, 22, yeah. In. Now, this is why I've put them down here next to this cold area. Because hopefully that should keep this at a decent temperature. So, uh, that's going to be planted. Blossom seed. And another one. And another one. We need one more. But all of this is ready to be harvested. Now, do I put a ration box down here somewhere? to keep it cold. It's minus 16 down here, good lord. So let's have room for a couple of ration boxes. So let's dig that out. Right, go. Oh, Tyler. Stepping in, stepping in dirty water. That's not very clever. Uh, we should mop that up. Let's get that mopped up, that's a priority. 
Get all that mopped up for me, please, guys. Uh, I don't think they, they can't reach that. That's okay. This is minus 23. Are you getting any warmer? Are you melting? Doesn't seem to be. At least it's certainly not happening quickly. Where are we? Stress is awesome. Calories, we could do with a little bit of food. So let's have a bit of a harvest on that. Keep a little bit of food coming in. But I'm not going to bring in too much until we get this. Look at this. This is stifled, toasty environment. Because it's 22.7 degrees there. Man. We may actually have to take this down a little bit further. So, all right, let's dig. Let's dig that and that out. And then we'll, once they've done that, we'll put some tiles under these. Do I put gas permeables in? Yeah, I suppose I could put gas permeables in. Um, yeah, that's fine. So, boom. And we'll get another planter box going. Where are we? Planter box. Planter box is in food. Planter box. Which I can't put in yet. Come on, guys. Go, 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 go. There's loads, of, there's loads more stuff than I want to do. Now, let's have a look up here. There's massive, look at that, massive patch of algae up here. And there's a m nice big patch of algae up here. So we're definitely going to keep going up here. There's a bunch of coal. Uh, we're going to clip the corner of that is the only problem. So I think we're going to have to fill that in. Yeah. So uh, base, we're going to put just like a regular tile there. And this is going to be top priority once they get there. So fill that in. And the ladder is just going to go straight up there. This ladder down here. What have we got? Oh, look, look. More giant ice carrots. Awesome. And what am I doing? I was putting this ladder in, wasn't I? Oh, this is all falling down here. That's fine. And uh, let's just let's just keep going. Yep, just keep going, guys. Right. So, uh, how are our plants? This is just a uh, whoa, 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 <laughs> Wendy. <laughs> When did you lunatic? Deconstruct. Go. And that should be a blossom seed plant. Uh, will somebody come and let... Oh, they've all gone to bed. You're stuck there for the night, Wendy. <laughs> no, help! Whoa, 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 whoa. She is... No, she's breathing. She's okay. Oh, come on, let her out. Now, nah, thank you, Tyler. There we go. Oh, oh, she's bursting for the... Oh, no. Oh, Wendy. Poor Wendy. Uh, how embarrassing. Uh, let's have a good old mop in here, then. Poor Wendy. So has that gone down? That's gone down here. Let's mop that up. Uh, yeah, that's a good idea. Uh, and they can't get to that. Oh, oh, and they can't, they can't get to this to mop it. Yeah, which at the end of the day, it's not really not terribly important. So let's, um, let's put that in there. I could deconstruct that, let them mop it. Well, if I deconstructed that one, then they can, you know, what, I might do that. Because otherwise I'll forget. You know what I'm like? I'll forget. And then it'll be a complete disaster. Uh, so let's have, what do I want? I want a planter. Which is going to go in there. There we go. You've mopped it all up now. Good lads. Good lads. Let's get a tile in there. Right. And that needs to be planted up with a blossom seed. Plant. Good job. Don't get stuck again. All right. How's the temperature in here? So 17. Well, that should be nice for them. That should be a nice temperature for these guys. This is not going to be a particularly nice area, though. So we're going to have tiles. Oh, I should have held down the shift key. I should have held down the shift key. Let's try that again with the shift key. If you hold down the shift key... Okay, I was holding the shift key then. Why the hell didn't that work? Let's try that again. 
Oh, does it, does it work with tiles? It should do. Yes, it does. Look. Ha. Good. Maybe my shift key wasn't working. I have no idea. Right, so then we want to dig out this layer. And in fact, we want to dig out all of this. Let's, uh, let's dig this stuff out. There we go. Good job. Um, so I can tell them to dig all of that. This is going to stress them out a little bit, though, being in the cold water. They're not going to like that very much. I just need to keep an eye on the story. It's Sky who's stressing out. Um, Sky, let's get you back over here and do some research. Calm you down. Ooh, now, ah, that's a good point. We need to get a supercomputer going. Now, supercomputers apparently have been having heating issues along with um, coal generators, apparently, have been having a bit of a nightmare. So we've got to explore that. Let's get, let's just work our way through and we'll get all of the novice research done. And then we'll kind of worry about getting the, the supercomputer super done later. Uh, we want to cheer Sky up. So I want some nicer decor around here, I think. How about, what's the decor around there? It's kind of okay. But I think it might be nice if we put in, I don't know, maybe a blank canvas. Yeah, let's, let's get that. And let's prioritize that so that Sky does that first. Go. Well, actually, anybody can build it. And then I need to prioritise it again so Sky decorates it. Alrighty. Yeah, do I want another... Oh, food beyond reach. I need to get these harvested. Oh, that's That needs to be done as a priority. So, harvest that one. And harvest that one. And harvest that one. That's like, what, four and a half thousand? Let's bring in like six thousand. Harvest that one. Now, how are our blossoms doing? Oh, they're growing. 22%. Hooray. That is really good news. That is really good news. Things are going fairly well. Here we go. 3,000. There's another 3,000 coming in. So that'll keep them fed for a couple of days. We've got more wood mill wood coming in. We've got our bristle wood. Yeah, how many seeds have we got? We've only got one seed. Food shortage. So I suppose we can, yeah, let's just set this to six, maybe. And you, boom. Alrighty, how are we doing? We've got algae, got loads of fertilizer, so that's good. All right, we've got food coming in from there. There is other food that I could dig up, like these um, these buried muck roots, which would provide us with some, some food. So we're not kind of absolutely desperate for food at the moment. But, um, yeah, these will be coming in again fairly soon. So we've got two more harvests on those. I'm hoping by that point we'll have these up and running. Uh, right, base. We want gas permeable tiles. Now, do I, do I put like one more either side? So that would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then... Yeah, we'll leave it at that. We'll leave it at that. Sky stress is coming down. Good. Uh, I need to prioritise that, don't I? Yeah. Decorate that, Sky. Decorate your environment. Knock yourself out. Sweet. Uh, I've got to finish the base off. There's still stuff to be swept up. So let's have a bit of a sweep going on. Let's, uh, let's clean the areas that they're kind of most using. So let's... I don't know. Let's, let's sweep all of that maybe sweep that as well there's some room in there there's some room in there so hopefully they can cope with that alrighty looking good looking good do I want to bring another duplicate in at this point how are we doing with our oxygen our oxygen is only just positive so actually I'm not going to bring another duplicate in yet we'll we'll hold off on that and plus it'll give my my patrons more chance to to supply their names and things. Right, what I want to do is get another row of tiles across here. So, yeah, we can do the whole thing across there now. Good. And in fact, we can dig the whole of that out. So, get that done. 
Alrighty. Sweet. Sweet. Things are coming together. Right, you can be harvested. How are we doing down here? These are growing 35%. So, yeah, we're getting there. We're getting there. I should maybe plant up another row of millwood, but... Hmm, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, what do I want down here? I want to put another planter box in here. Let's see, what's the temperature? 19 degrees. Which is kind of just about right. I'm, I'm wondering if I dig this out and put some more in. The only thing is, let's see, because I put that at that height. Now, one, two, three, four. So the floor actually should be there. <laughs> so I've put that in really at the wrong height. So do I, I don't know, do I maybe drop that down? And actually those should be one higher, shouldn't they? They should. Oh, look at Tyler go. Build, 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 build. Awesome. Good job. Uh, how are we doing now? Batteries. Now, this is one of the reasons that I want to dig up here, because, like, hot stuff. I want to put hot stuff, like, kind of well away from the base, if I can. Because temperature management is definitely a big issue in this. Now, I could dig down here, and then we could harvest this millwood over here. Uh, we could also get... Look, we've got thimble fibre, and that's for making clothes, which we definitely want to do. And I want to, I do want to explore down here. Let's, uh, let's have a bit of an explore down here, shall we? Let's go as far as we can go, because what I'd love to find is a, is a geezer, a steam geezer. And it, some people will say it's geyser. I say geezer. You say geezer, and I say geyser. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, God, you ever do things and go, God, I wish I hadn't done that. Right, deconstruct that and put a gas permeable tile. In fact, I think I'm going to put, I'm going to put like maybe two on the outside of here. So, you know what, let's get deconstruct that. And we'll put two there. And so we've got two, two, two. Yeah, do I put two in the middle as well? Yeah, I suppose I could. If I deconstruct that one. So. Uh, no, 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 no. Cancel, cancel. So I'd want two gas permeables in the middle. And you there, and you there. Alright, cool. And then over here. I should do, I should do a similar thing. I need to change this, swap these tiles out. So let's get that done. So I deconstruct that. Deconstruct that. We want a couple of gas permeables in. Boom, and... Well, we'll have one there as well, so we need to deconstruct that one as well. This is, again, just to let carbon dioxide out. So, yeah, we want tile and tile. What am I making those out of? Copper oil. Yeah, that's fine. I haven't got a problem with that. Um, over here. Now, what do I do here? Well, we've got that there so that's kind of okay i should probably put another gas permeable there maybe but, but it's three wide well four wide with the two ladders no i don't think we need to i don't think we need to we'll just put regular tiles in um what am i putting these in with cancel try that again what am i putting these in with we're putting them in with sandstone and we've got absolutely tons of yeah sandstone's fine sandstone is fine Okay, uh, I should probably start filling in these. Oh, no. Cancel build. Um, and yes, you can overlay tile. So even though I'm deconstructing, I could just like overlay with the new one. But like old habits die hard. Uh, we want a gas permeable in there and there and there. Although, actually, I'm not sure about those two. I'm not quite sure if I'm going to go up any further over there. So we'll just leave that as it is for now. Uh, we've got zero calories. Let's uh, let's harvest that as a priority. We've got anything else around that we can harvest? No. 
Now, I've got a muck root there I could dig up. How close are you to being harvestable? You're 89%. That, can we... Uh, no, we've got, we got no more blossom seeds. Um, let's see, we've got five duplicants. You need two and a half millwood plants <clears throat> per duplicant. We've got eight there. Nine... 10, 11, well, not that one, 10, 11, 12, 13. So we should actually have enough for now. And if I dig through to that one, which I could do now, yeah, let's do that. Let's dig through there. Uh, let's dig through like that, and then that, harvest. There we go. And that will give us access to that one as well. Which is a little bit more. And that's 93%. So that's pretty good. How close are we with these? These are 47. So we've got another five cycles before we can start harvesting those. But then we get like five harvests from those. Which would be kind of good. Um, I haven't found any more seeds. Oh, see that's saying I've got a blossom seed. What? So why is that saying I haven't got a blossom seed? What the hell's going on there? Okay. Whatever. Okay. Yeah I, yeah, I don't understand that. What are we finding up here? Huge load of algae. Awesome. Huge, huge, monstrous load of algae up here. So algae, not a problem. Algae, uh, we've got 6,000 in at the moment. Uh, down here, we got we found the ice carrots. Oh, look at this. Oh, my God. This is huge. And most of this is either granite or ice. God, there is a lot of water in here. If you if you unfreeze this, oh my God, that's a lot of water. Sky, what are you doing? Oh, have we done? Oh, we've done that research. Let's get the next uh, bit of research done. Let's do temperature modulation. We're just doing the novice research bit of it. So, yeah, yeah, get that done, Sky. Right, what do I, what else do I want? Um, I, could, I could really do with a decent battery. Oh, good, 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 good. Let's harvest that, make it priority six. And how are we doing up here? Oh, those can all be harvested. Hooray. Let's harvest priority six. Boom. Right, that solves our problem for now. But, and we've got that coming in. I have got my emergency muck roots if I get into trouble. Are there any more stuff around? Eh, no, not really. We need to use our morbs to eat the chlorine. But that's a problem for another day, I think. Yeah, right now, it's food and exploration. We can extend this ladder down a little bit more. And we can definitely extend this ladder down like a whole load. Okay, and yeah, so I guess we yeah, just keep going up and down. Now, here we've got the same issue. We're going to run into this bit of chlorine. Um, so I think what we'll do is we'll, we'll still go straight up, but we'll bang in a couple of tiles at priority nine. Boom, boom. Yeah, tiny bit of chlorine we can handle. All right. Anybody going to actually get some food? Yeah, we got some food. Oh, oh I didn't do the uh, ration, ration boxes, did I? No, no, no. no. Oh, good Lord. I dug it out. Never put the ration boxes in. Uh, right, so what do I want? R ration boxes. That's under food. Ration box. So should we put... I, I, I mean, any reason why I wouldn't build a couple? You know what? Let's put that in there and we'll prioritise one. So get that done ASAP. We can now get rid of that. So, deconstruct that ration box, which means I could put another running wheel in here. Another hamster wheel. Cool. We haven't had to use the massage tables yet, which I'm kind of staggered about. Although Tyler's going to need it soon if we're not careful. We need more storage around the place. Um, now we can harvest these because we've got somewhere to put the food and it won't go rotten. Uh, which means now we've got a place to store food. We've got one more harvest coming in from these, so I think we should get some more. 
I think we should get some more planted up. Don't you think? How close are we with these? 55%. About another four days to go. Have we discovered any more blossom seeds? No, we haven't. Whoa, Tyler. Oh my God, quick. Deconstruct that. Good Lord. Oh. Oh, and of course he's going to make a mess. Oh, heavens above. Mop. Priority nine. And mop down there as well. Yeah, they're on the case. They're on the case. Good job. Well done, guys. Okay, now we are going to have to deconstruct a tile so we can get to that. Let's deconstruct that one, I guess. Go. Go, go, go. Um, am I going to worry about putting a hamster wheel in right now? Probably not. I am going to worry about planting up these millwood seeds. So, millwood seed. And that one. And... Boom. And this, and this, and this puppy, and this one, and that. Right, so, we're not going to starve to death. Oh, come on, get planted. Right, so we're not going to starve to death in the, in the like, immediate future. Let's prioritise these to six. So that that gets done. We've got 13 mealwood seeds, we've got seven briar seeds, and one blossom seed that apparently doesn't exist. What the hell is going on there? I have no idea. No idea. Not a clue. Do I care? Yeah, not overly. I've got my reservoir completely sorted out now. We've got a couple of algae terrariums. That's good. We are currently positive on our oxygen. Just. So we've got a slight net gain each day. Let's get... Should we get another hamster wheel put in? Let's get another hamster wheel put in. So... Uh, if I'm the thing is, if I'm going to put a hamster, another hamster wheel in, then I should seriously think about batteries. So let's harvest that, and we can harvest that as well. Set that prior to priority six. Uh, oh, we can harvest that as well. So yeah, the food's rolling in. That's not a problem. We can dig out the rest of this algae. No reason why we wouldn't. Let's try that again. Priority, not priority nine, priority five. Uh, we can dig out that algae there. In fact, we could dig all the way across there. I'm just wondering, would I want to do that? Well, we've got a couple of muck roots as well. Uh, where's the muck root? Oh, they're picking them up, good. So that stuff's getting put away. Uh, we should probably sweep that. Let's do a little bit of a priority sweep on that. Because we don't want that to be too nasty for them. Now we've got a little vacuum there. That would do, wouldn't it? If we just dug like that out. And had a little battery room going on. If I was to put tiles. Like there. And there now the only thing is i'm worried about overheating these damn things so i am thinking about giving them some extra space so no uh you can back a bit there one two three four now nah, i'm going to do it there i think now how close to that is that to the base but heat rises Sh shouldn't be a problem well we'll try it and if it's a nightmare then we'll change it so let's dig all of that out Right, go. And then batteries. Where's batteries? Because we I'm I don't want to waste power if I can avoid it. Where's where's batteries? Oh there it is. Hiding. Yeah. Wolframite. What the hell is Wolframite? I haven't seen that before. I haven't seen anybody mention that on the forums. Wolframite? What the hell is Wolframite? Oh, I'm gonna have to go and do some research. Um we'll put these in with copper ore, I suppose, for now. I'm gonna put one there, one there. Uh, let's put you in there, you in there. Right, now I can do my cabling. So, uh, now do I use heavy watt wire? Hmm. This only carries like a kilowatt. I 
I'm thinking we should probably use heavy duty. Like, just in case. You think? Yeah, me too. Right, let's... Let's do that. And... Do that. I need more copper ore. Where the hell can I get some copper ore? There's copper ore here, isn't there? There's loads of copper ore here. Let's do a bit of digging out of this. So, let's have... Um, that's all copper ore. That's copper ore. That's copper ore. So is that. That should be plenty for now. Oh, it's sleepy time again. Go on. You get your zeds in, boys. We've got five and a half thousand calories in our little ration box down here. Oh, they're grabbing some water. Is that for the terrariums? Yeah, that's for terrariums. Oh, by the way, I will just mention, because several people have been going on about, ah, oh, the, the algae deoxidizer's terrible. You should be using terrariums. Um, and I think it... I, let me pause for a second while I'm yabbering about this, because things will get out of control. Um, and I think it's because people look at the, the algae terrarium and they go, oh, it turns like 30 grams of algae into 40 grams of oxygen compared with the algae deoxidizer, which um, takes a, a kilogram of algae and turns it into only 600 grams of, um, of, of, uh, of oxygen, right? Um, but I think people are forgetting that these things, for the 30 grams of algae, also need 300 grams of water. These things drink water like there's no tomorrow. Right. So if you th and, and bear in mind, all that water that you're putting into there, you could put that into an electrolyzer and produce oxygen and hydrogen. Right. So if you think terrariums are really, really great, think again. I'm only using them like very sparingly right at the beginning. I used them massively in my first series and it was a disaster. Used all my water. Total nightmare. Total nightmare. So there you go. Um, bu 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 rant over, by the way. <laughs> let's dig out. Eh, let's dig out this. Up there, at least. Food's good. Food's good. Let's have a look at the reports. So, let's see. So, we've been positive, 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 positive. Yeah, we've been very positive on the, on the oxygen side. Um, calories is fine. Power, we've been wasting tiny bit of power. So, those batteries are all done. Well, almost. We've got the basic cable. Let's finish off the cabling then. So, let's run this heavy watt stuff down here to here and run it across to there. Now, these are 400 each. So that'll be okay on ordinary cable. So for now, we'll just bang in. Oh, and up. <laughs> need more copper. Quick, prioritize. Prioritize digging the copper out. Otherwise, we can't get the cables done. Oh, oh, bristle blossom. 81%. So we've almost got that coming in, which is awesome. Uh, we can dig, dig further down here. So let's keep that going. So ladder. Yeah, keep going down there. How are we doing up here? Yeah, we've still got to do that. So, I don't know. Uh, do I... Is that is that gas leaking through there? I think that gas is leaking through there. It The, the, the problem is, with the, I've got to say... I agree with everybody who said to me that they don't like this new gas overlay. I wouldn't have minded it if they'd added it as an extra one, right? But the original... See, this is now the oxygen overlay. I want the gas overlay back. So that... Because it was so much easier to see what was going on. Don't you think? Like everybody I've spoken to has said, yeah. Like the old one. Don't like the new one. So, there you go. Anyway. Um, yeah, so... Let's see, that's we got oxygen. I don't know. I can't tell whether it's leaking through or not. But I think what we um I think I think we'll end up putting a couple of tiles in here. So you know what? I'm gonna prioritize uh that and that. 
I, I am kind of tempted to like seal seal that off across there as well. But yeah, that'll do for now. And we've got some little bit of hydrogen in there, but that'll float up, so that's not a problem. All right, cool. How are we doing for algae? Yeah, we're still okay for algae. We've got loads of coal, so that's not a problem. Uh, now, domesticating these hatches. Now, what we can do, if I get a storage compactor, uh, let's dig. Let's dig up this muck root and dig. Let's just get you. Let's get you dug. Somebody come and do this. Here we go. Thank you, Zach. Can you reach that? You should be able to reach that from where you are. So if I say sweep that, oh, there's see, but Wendy's got it. Excellent. And she's going to scoff it on the spot. She likes a bit of bit of that, bit of muck root. Uh, if we put a storage compactor in here. Um, and let's, pri let's prioritize this. Although I kind of want to push them over, over to here actually. Um, so what we could do? Well, let's try. Let's try and put one there, and let's try and put one there. Uh, let's prioritize this one first, I guess, because if we can get that one built, go. Um. If I deconstruct that tile, right, quick, go and build this. Uh, let's make it priority nine. Go do that. And I'm going to want a tile on the top of it as well, aren't I? Yep. And that needs to be priority nine as well. Oh, they're harvesting that. Yeah, I, you know what? I suppose you can harvest that and that while you're there. Okay, now we want to get that done. And the same, we want a priority nine tile on the top. Now, apparently, hatches, well, in fact, any creatures, will not go through a door which is either closed or on auto. <clears throat> so what I want to do is now... Um, bum, bum, bum. Did I put in... <clears throat> oh, I put in pneumatic doors. I meant to put in pressurised, but actually pneumatic would work. If I open that so that these hatches can go through and then maybe I can trap them in this part and to be honest I don't even mind giving them a little bit more room over here so maybe we dig that out like that oh what the hell am I doing Pfft, I'm trying to sweep it <laughs> yeah you can't do that guy right let's do that <clears throat> uh, do I yeah I, do I prioritize it yeah I suppose so Let's prioritise that. Right, good. Um, and then that is probably going to get moved. <laughs> In fact, it is going to get moved. Uh, and I should put... You know what? I should put a tile there as well. Oh, see? They're eating the resources over there. Good. Uh, do I want to prioritise this? Yeah, I do. I'll... Well, no, apparently they can go through those doors. Okay, well... Oh, man. Well, that kind of screws things up. Okay, what about if I, if I lock that? Oh, no, oh, man. Not now. Oh, don't go all the way across there. Go back, go back. Right, now somebody go and lock them in. Quick, 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 quick. Uh, this is actually the priority, guys. <laughs> quick. You know what? I'm going to put a blooming pressure door in. <laughs> I've had enough of this. Quick. Put in a damn pressure... Uh, manual airlock. Um, which we're going to put there. And we'll put a tile on the top. And that's going to be priority nine. And that's going to be priority nine. Maybe it's maybe it's the pressurised airlocks that they can't go through. Um, have I got that? Yeah, that's nine. That's nine. Okay, and that will change back to auto. Okay, go. Quick, 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 quick! Before these guys move, we've got them in the perfect place. Let's get the damn thing built quick. Quick, 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 quick! Go, 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 go! 
Yeah, oh, we've got the copper ore. Just needs to get built. If we can get this done and we can domesticate our hatches, that's awesome. So let's say we've got, we've got a bit of granite there. Igneous rock, granite. I kind of want the granite. So I'm going to say... Um, yeah, am I, yeah, no, what the hell. We, we're going to have loads of, freaking loads of granite all over the place. Let them eat it. Uh, that can now be deconstructed. That can be deconstructed. That can be deconstructed. And that can be deconstructed. Boom, 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 boom. Right, then what I want to do is put in uh, this thing over here. So I want to put that storage compactor over there. Right, and that will bump up to a seven. Get that done. How are we doing? Food's fine, stress is fine. Uh, did I do that with obsidian? It's fine. Obsidian's fine. Now, why am I putting a storage compactor over there? Well, it's to feed the hatches with. That's the whole point of this. They will eat your resources even if they're in a storage compactor. Here we go. Boom. Okay, so the idea is we set this, pause for a second, we set this to something that we've got loads of or that we don't want or whatever. Now, let's see, we've got, we've got loads of sandstone. We'll set this to store, uh, where are we? Raw mineral, sandstone. There we go. So, and am I going to keep it full? No, nah, I'm just going to let them do it normally. Um, that will deconstruct because we don't really want that there. Cool. And that tile can be deconstructed now. Good. Alrighty. So, get rid of that. Get rid of that. Um, you know what? I'm, I'm going to prioritise that just for a second. Just so that they get some stuff in there. I'm kind of tempted to sweep that granite now. Yeah, sweep. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it on a priority nine. Sweep that quick. Right, so now they've got some sandstone in there. Yeah, grab the grab the granite. Go, 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 go. Yeah, I can sweep there as well, actually. Yep, lovely. Right, that's all the nice granite taken away. Oh, one more bit. Come on, somebody grab it. It's Nanny G. Oh, no, no, no. Nanny G's filling up. Right, that's enough. Right, I can go back to normal priority now. Cool. So we fed the hatches. Okay, well, they're going to eat that bit of granite, which is a shame. Yeah, cancel the sweep. They can eat that bit. So they will eat this, eat this stuff. See, they're eating. Here we go. He's eating from the storage compactor, from his little feeding tray, and he's pooping out coal. See? And he digs himself in there. Cool. So now we've got a supply, a constant, forever supply of coal. <laughs> All right. Nice job. Right. Um, now, the batteries. Oh, these two batteries. Are, oh, all our batteries are full. Almost. So, you know what? We don't really need to put the second wheel in. We've got the space for the second wheel. So, that's really good. So, maybe now we just focus on a bit of decor, I think. There and there. And that's going to make our... Shaft, our, our shafts, nice. <laughs> that sounded so wrong. Oh, that's the wrongest thing I've said in this series so far. Um, so we've done all of that. We've done all of that. Let's do pressure management. Actually, we should probably do, well, I don't know. Should we use, no, it's just do them in order. They'll get done fast enough that it doesn't really matter. So Sky, Sky, go and do your research. Now, at the same time that they're doing that, I'll get some more sweeping going on, I suppose. So they can sweep that up. Um, I would like them to sweep all of this eventually. But, oh, we've got a food shortage. Oh, dear. Well, we better, we better do a quick priority harvest then, haven't we? There we go. Harvest that stuff, guys. Yay, that food's coming just in time. We've got stuff down there. We've got, we've got five and a half thousand already. And then we've got all of this. So that's going to be sweet. All righty. So I've got to say, things are going freaking fabulously so far. How have we found... We still haven't found a steam... A steam geyser. Geyser. Whichever you want. Uh, I, I suppose we can extend the ladder. 
Now, I just need to be a little bit careful about going through this abyssalite because breaking through abyssalite is like quite a big deal these days, but there isn't a steam geyser in here. Or well, it doesn't look like there is, but we'll we'll go down a bit further and see what we see before we go any further down there. Uh, this one, well, we can go down. Oh, actually, that goes through there. Oh, that works out peachy. Well, let's go. Let's keep going all the way down there as far as we can go. By the way, if you're wondering what these ice carrots do, they um, they spit out cold air. You can see it's like minus 40 degrees over here. So if you want to cool stuff down, you can uh, you can plant these up and they'll spit out cool air, which is kind of nice. So we've got, we've got more. So we've got, what have we got? We've got, we got like seven carrots now. We have four up there, three down here. So this is going to stay pretty frosty in here. Um, it's going to be interesting to see what's further on down. We've got our bristle blossoms ready for harvest. My God. Well, you know what, guys? We're going to leave it there for this episode. Things are going... Well, I don't know what you think, but so far, things are going pretty damn excellent. I may even put some more batteries in. Now, what's the temperature up here? Well, the temperature's not getting too crazy. So I don't know what people are talking about with the batteries. No, I, I mean, that's like no problem. I could have put those closer together. That would have been fine. I don't know, maybe maybe because I've spaced them out, they're fine. So, I don't know, maybe we dig out, like, uh, another layer. The hydrogen's going to stay up there anyway. So, yeah, we could maybe dig out another layer. I could maybe dig a layer down here, actually. Which would probably make more sense. Yeah, that's probably exactly what I'll do. Get some more batteries going. So, we've got, uh, we've got battery room. We're good on power. We've got some lighting going. We've got loads of sculptures all over the place and more going on. We've got Sky's working on... Oh, Sky's just put that one in. Let's have a look at the decor up there. So it's awesome here. It's pretty horrible over by the uh, the Millwood plants because it's all it's all creepy crawly. It's crawling over plants. So it's going to be like, not particularly nice. But once we get all of these done, this should be a bit better. We could, um, we could also think about putting a, a bit of extra lighting in to improve the decor down this shaft. And um, other than that, I don't know, guys. Like, leave me your comments. Tell me what you think. What, like, what should I do next? I mean, other than kind of exploring and just keeping on with things, uh, we've got loads of coal. We've domesticated our hatches. Look, coal, coal. We've got almost a thousand kilograms of coal. Doesn't get much better than that. Uh, I could do with. Oh, we've got two thimble reed seeds now, so we could start growing for our clothes awesome oh well you know what that's going to be the next thing i think we're gonna i guess we're gonna have to step up the research a little bit which i'll do once uh, once sky has finished doing these decorations uh we'll bring in i think probably another duplicant and get another algae deoxidizer running i think i think that's probably what we'll do but i'm gonna wait for your comments so leave me your comments leave me a like if you enjoyed the video and uh, make sure you subscribed uh, is there any other things that YouTubers say at the end of videos? I don't think so. So we'll leave it there. <laughs> Catch you for the next one. Peace out. <laughs>